What's going on, good people? In today's video here for Skyrim, I'm gonna give you guys a few tips on how to reach high Hrothgar. So with that on, let's get started. So if you're new to Skyrim, uh, you might be wondering, how do you reach this location? So you can see this location from your map. If you bring up the world map, you can see it right there, high Hrothgar. I always have trouble saying that word. Now there are a few different ways you can get here. Uh, I covered this in a previous video, but the most standard way to get there is to go from Ivarstead. And the quickest way to get to Ivarstead is to go from Helgen. Um, you could go the long way, leaving White Run from the north. But either which way, man, the best way to reach High Hrothgard is to go from Ivarstead. So let's fast travel to Ivarstead. And you will actually uh, have to proceed this way for a quest, The Way of the Voice. But if you're curious, I'll just show you how to get here in any event. So just make your way in this direction, looking at the pretty skies. And it wouldn't be a bad thing to investigate this town right here. It is a small town, but you can get a few quests if you talk to the NPCs. Let me show you where we're at on the map in Ivarstead. So once you read Ivarstead, just cross this bridge. Like I said, go talk to a couple of the NPCs, you know, chat with them. I think Kilmek will give you a quest. So will Nafari. So hit up the inn, see what they're all about. So now once we get here, we got to travel up the 7,000 steps, the infamous 7,000 steps. It ain't really 7,000 steps. And um, at least I don't think so. And along your way, you'll come across a few different things. So you'll come across like an NPC character that you could chat with. You will fight a number of wolves, so be prepared to do battle as you venture and traverse up these infinite staircases here. And just pay attention to the path. It's sometimes easy to get lost, so just look for the stairs, or the steps I should say, and then look for a few posts. You'll see like these posts in the distance. I'll show you exactly what I mean. We just keep traveling. So there's a post right there. So just look for those kind of posts. And eventually, man, you can hit up and encounter one Super Saiyan Frost Troll. I mean, the difficulty spike with this dude was unreal, right? So just be mindful of that. I know why this cat's so much stronger than some of the other enemies, especially for this particular point. But uh, you'll come across this uh, Frost Troll. So just be ready for him. When you bounce up at them. So you bounce up at them around this location right here. Dude could be a handful, so just be mindful of that. He could hit you and do significant damage. So be mindful of old King Gong right there, man. So keep proceeding on forward after you finish with Super Saiyan Frost Troll. Just proceed along the steps. And then eventually you will reach High Rothgard. We're almost there. And like I say, this could be a good thing to do early on if you just want to do it for the heck of it. Um, so that when you do get the quest, you can just fast travel to the appropriate location. So we're almost at the tower. So we're here, nearby, high Rothgard. Uh, I think it's the tallest point in Skyrim, or at least definitely one of the tallest points. But somebody could correct me in the comments below. So this is where we're at. As you can see, we've hit almost the top of the mountain. You'll have to come this way for a quest. And then go from there. Uh, so folks, that is pretty much that, man. Just wanted to give you guys this quick tip walkthrough video in Skyrim showing you how to reach High Rothgard. Let me know what you guys thought on the comments below. As always, I appreciate the support. And with that there, fellas, I guess I will see you guys in the next video.